Hello friends, today we're going to discuss the Anthony Edwards 2020 Panini Prism Rookie Card, number 258 in a PSA 10 grade. We're going to establish what I think it's worth, what my entrance and exit points are on this card as well. So, uh, as you can see, we've got a data set of 15 sales that happened recently on eBay with their associated price, shipping, and their total all-in price as well. So, uh, yellow, green, and orange are the most important numbers that we are gathering from this information, and we'll discuss those in a moment. But first, let's talk about the graph. Relatively consistent with a few outliers. We've got a couple of pretty high options that were sold here. People just trying to get their hands on the card, it looks like. Not really playing that uh, bidding war uh, to their, mo their, their best strength, let's just say. Uh, we also have the occasional uh, low guy down here, $79 uh, as far as a bid winner on that one. Congratulations to the buyer there. Great deal on this card. But uh, we do have relative consistency with, consistency with this card, which is what you'd expect from a 2020 um, set as well. So no longer a brand new rookie in the card. Anthony Edwards has established himself as a true star in the league. But on to the numbers. $99.43 is the average bid price it took to win yourselves one of these cards. So right around $100. If you're really looking just to get your hands on this card quick, uh, I would say you'd be pretty fortunate. And well, I, I'd say you'd be, be able to get it at that $100 price point pretty easily, right? All in, they're spending $103.19 on average. So is that what this card is worth? I don't think so. Why? Because, well, it doesn't take into account the seller's fees. That's right. There's about a 13 to 15% seller fee that they have to take right off the top of the totals. And that brings this yellow number down to $84.51. I would say that that is closer to the worth of this PSA 10 graded rookie card. $84.51. But if I'm looking for an entrance point, I like to get in on the bottom third. So that's down one, two, three, four, five. Looks like we're looking at about one, two, I can't count. One, two, three, four, five. Looks like we're looking at right about $77.35. Um, so for me, that's closer to my entrance point. However, I do have to consider those three uh, high auction wins that happened, right? One at 135, 122, and 111. Uh, so that makes me a little bit wary that this number even might be a little high, a little rich for my blood. So I'm going to say my entrance point is $75 as far as opening offer. Uh, well, the, the, the offer that I want the actual seller to take, uh, depending upon how how motivated they are to to sell? How to how motivated they are to move their cards in general? So seventy five dollars is my opening point. Uh, as far as an exit, uh, I certainly want to be in the uh, top three. I mean top five. So one, two, three, four, five. Looks like we're looking at a price point right around a hundred dollars and ten cents. If you wanted to pull off a buy it now option uh, on eBay. I'm sure you could swing that pretty easily. Again, that's awfully close to that $99 on average. So if you needed to sort of turn and burn this card, you could certainly make that happen. However, if you felt like waiting, you probably could get a few people to jump on board at that $115 price point. So uh, keep that in mind. Even on an auction, you're probably not going to lose out on too much money if you do uh, chance it. Hopefully they build you up. But I think you're better off with a buy it now. Uh, right around $100 plus. Uh, that would, of course, bring you to that $85 price point. And if you were able to enter in at $75 bucks even, or even a little bit lower, you're going to be making about $10 profit. So um, that's why that entrance point for me is so important, because after all that effort, you can find yourself making nothing. Even if you went on the average of $84.51, you'd be making about $0.50 cents if you bought in at that point. Why? Because... There's fees everywhere. So keep that in mind. Next time you're out in a card show and they're saying, look at these last three comps. These are what they sold for. Make sure you point out that he's very, he or she, I should say, are very conveniently omitting the fees that most people are paying on auction sites to sell their cards. Anyways, valuation for me on this card, about $85. My entrance point is $75 and my exit point is $100 plus. Let me know what you think about these numbers and whether or not you've got different valuation on this card. Take care, friends.